Hello everyone, we will continue the topic SAP script and in this video we will learn how to display the current page number and total page number in the output of SAP script. And yes, if you see any real time layout, always at the top we have current page number and total page number. Suppose if we have five pages in the output, so at the top, it will be one of five, two of five, three of five, four of five, and five of five. So we will display now the current page number and total page number. If you remember, we did the same to same thing in smart forms also. At that time, to display the current page number, we used the system variable SFSY hyphen page. And to display the total page number, we used SFSY hyphen form pages. Now we will go for same to same thing in SAP script. Now in SAP script, Whenever I want to display the current page number, I will simply, simply write page. And whenever I want to display the total page number, I will write SAP script hyphen form pages. So with the help of these, I will print the current page number and total page number. And yes, same to same, I will treat this as a separate section. Separate section means I will create a separate window in the SAP script. So I will go to the script. This is our script. So firstly, I will go to the windows. Yes, I'm currently in windows itself. So I will go for edit create element. Now I will give some name to the window. Suppose I will say page window. Suppose PG win. Page window. Suppose I will give this page window. Suppose I will give that description page window. I will go for OK. So I created one window. Now I need to integrate this window onto the page. So what I will do, I will simply, simply go to page windows. You all know whenever you want to integrate, you need to go to page windows. See, as of now, we have multiple pages now. So just make sure you are on right page. So currently I'm on page one. So I will go to edit, create element. Now this window is coming. So I will select this window. Now we all know we need to give that dimensions to the window. Suppose here itself. Here itself, I will display the current page and total page number. So I will take the left margin, suppose zero. Suppose top margin, I will also take zero. Suppose width, width I will take suppose four centimeter. Suppose height, I will take two centimeter. With the help of form painter, I will check one window should not collide with other window. So I will go to settings, form painter, graphical form painter. Now it is not colliding with any other window. It is right. I will deselect. Now this thing I want to display on next page also. So it means I need to integrate this on the next page also. So I will go to next page. 
page two. This is the important points. So I will go to edit, create element. So I'm taking this window on the next page also. Same to same dimensions appear. Now I'm activating. So I integrated the window on both the pages. So I will go to page one and I will create a text element. So I will go to edit, just make sure whatever is appearing in blue color, it means that window is the selected one. Edit text elements. Now I will go for, go to change editor. Now here I will write, you all know whenever you want to display the values, you need to write in M percent. So what will be the current page? How I will print with the help of page? I will write off. Suppose off is hard coded, then I will write M percent. SAP script hyphen form pages. So it will print the current page. It will print the total pages. I will go for form and activate. I will check is the same thing replicated in page two also. So this is our page two. Edit text elements, same to same thing replicated for page two also, done. Now we will check the expected result. So I will run the S program. I will provide the order number. Now you can see page one of two, current page, total page. If I will go for next page, page two of two, this current page and total page. So what is the summary of this particular video? In this video, we studied how to print the current page and total page in SAP script. So we studied two variables. Whenever I want to print the current page number, I will go for page. And whenever I want to print the total page number, I will write SAP script hyphen form pages. And as a part of that, I treated as a separate section, means I created a separate window. I integrated that window on first page also. And page, I integrated that window on page one and page two. Yes, we provided that dimension and we use these variables by using M percent because we want to display the values. So that's it in this particular video. Thank you.